Hi, it's Adam and Lindsay from AKR Fitness, and today we're here to talk to you about the deadlift. In particular, just a few different ways that you can perform the exercise. Now, if you're new to deadlifting, or you haven't quite heard that term before, it's best to first try and understand the hip hinge pattern, which is just the movement our body makes when performing the exercise. We have a whole segment on that, so if you don't know what that is, best to go back to that other video and try to get to grips with that movement. Okay, so assuming you now know how to hip hinge, you're ready to start lifting some weights in the deadlift. Often we start off with a kettlebell, as this allows us to keep the weight fairly light and it's a good opportunity for us to practice the movement. So what Lindsay's gonna do, she's now gonna step over the weight, beginning by just standing up really tall and proud, and she's gonna perform that hip hinge to get down towards the weight. Okay, once she's there, it's just a case of standing up really tall and proud again. Good stuff, Lindsay, and let's see a couple more reps. Great. And once we're at the point where we're now feeling a little bit more comfortable and a little bit more confident with that exercise, we can move on to slightly different versions of the same move. So another way of performing the deadlift is using the trap bar that we've got out here. The trap bar is set out to distribute the weight around us a little bit more evenly than the kettlebell does, and we hold the weights from our side as opposed to out in front of us. Other than that though, it's the exact same move. So again, Lindsay's gonna step in, you're going to start by seeing her standing up really tall and proud and then just performing a few reps of the deadlift using the hip hinge pattern. Another version we can use is a straight bar. You may have seen the straight bar used in gyms or online. It's a really common tool to use for deadlifting, but once again, it is the exact same pattern of movement that we've been showing you on the trap bar and on the kettlebell. So finally again, Lindsay's gonna come back onto the bar, tall and proud, and using the hip hinge to deadlift. And there you have it, three different tools to perform the deadlift pattern. Let us know how you get on.